he's just up as Hulk Smash. Just Hulk. And today we will be making waffles. Waffle, waffles are yummy. And we're also gonna do waffles. a waffle challenge. Dun dun dun. dun. Waffle 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 waffle. So we're each gonna have waffles. We're gonna make three types of waffles: a mm -hmm. chocolate flavor, blueberry flavor, and cranberry flavor. <laughs> what we like? Cause one of us are gonna get one flavor. Cause I'm not sure if I like cranberry. This is our recipe. What? We are gonna draw for flavors. So one of us might get chocolate, maybe cranberry, or blueberry. So let's yeah. do it. Someone wants to go first. Me, me, me. Close your eyes. Okay. Oh, one. Only one, get only one, not two. I know, okay? Okay, I got one. What I is got it? chocolate chip, yay! Okay, okay come on. Your turn, or okay. Hulk. Draw, close your eyes. Okay, okay pick one, pick it one. Pick one. Did you get no. one? Here, yeah. what did you get? Um, you get cranberry! Yes! Yeah. And obviously cool. there's only one more, so then I get, let's see. Yeah, blueberry. I get... Let's preheat the wa the waffle iron. Plug it in. Eh. Almost eh. My waffle iron, I set it to three. In a large mixing bowl, mix dry ingredients together. Flour, sugar, baking powder, and salt. Let's add the sugar to the flour and when, when we add all of the dry ingredients, we'll mix it. Whoa. Sugar. Baking powder. And then some salt. Now let's mix it! Pour in milk, melted butter, vanilla extract, eggs, and squeeze a little lemon juice. Stir until well combined. I'm going to put in the milk. Whoa. Butter. It smells good. Vanilla extract. And some eggs. Whoa. Bloop, bloop. And some lemon juice. Let's mix it. Squeeze of lemon. Squeeze. What? There you go. Yeah. Mixing. We can also use a whisk. Yeah. Oops. Think it's good. It's the waffle mix is ready and the waffle iron is ready too. So let's get picky. Let's put some foil under the waffle maker so it's so when if the waffle mix falls out of the sides, it it will be easy to clean up. Pour batter in middle of in the middle of waffle iron. Use 
one cup of batter for Belgian style, and one Belgian for Belgian style, and one third cup for American style. The iron indicator light shows when it's done, and the waffles are golden brown and crisp. Ooh! For this iron maker, we are going to use one third cup. I mean one half cup. Here we go. First, we're making a regular waffle. You can grease your waffle iron with some oil so it's easy to clean up. Make sure it's everywhere. This recipe will make will give us 10 waffles. Awesome! Half a cup of batter in the middle. It's sizzling! Wow! That's good. Sizzling. For this waffle maker, it will take one and a half minutes. The light indicator will tell us when it's done. It will turn green. It's green! Let's see. Oh, it's hot. Wow. It's not round, but it's yummy. Let's take it out. Whoa. So yummy. Crispy. It's best when immediately served with butter. Yeah. Let's try to pick this up. Oh, it's hard. <laughs> I'm scared. Hard. That was easy. If you want a more soft waffle or a moist waffle, add some more milk. Now we're going to make chocolate chip waffle. This one is a chocolate chip. Yeah. Here we go. Now we just have to wait. I'm so excited and hungry. It's ready. Now we can take it out and put it on a plate. Yeah. There we go. Next is cranberry flavor. Here we go. Now I'm gonna close it. Yeah, here we go. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. It's good if you butter it right away. The cranberry waffle is ready. I'm scared. Woo, it's hot. Take it out. Butter right away. Butter, 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 I think it's gonna become purple. It's ready, let's check it out. It might be purple. And it's not purple, but it's okay. And it's yummy. It's purple on the inside. Let's take it out and put it on the plate. Let's put on butter. 
Ready, ready, ready. The rest of the batter will make it later. After we cook all of this, total of 10 waffles. For the first waffle, the cranberry waffle, you can see the tiny little pieces of cranberry in there. For the chocolate one, you can see some chocolate in there. Looks yummy. If you open it here, you can see some chocolate right there. Mm. And for the blueberry one, you can see a lot of spots everywhere of blueberry. There's even some blueberry right there. When served immediately with butter, maple syrup, or honey, and fruits. Now let's cut the waffle jelly! We will be... So the challenge is... We will be decorating our waffles with these. And the best looking waffle will be the winner of the challenge. Oh yeah. We will be I'll, putting I'll some honey. And we'll walk. Honey or some chocolate. And you can topping. And, and some of these I toppings. just want to win. I marshmallow. Let's stop. I like chocolate. I want cranberry. He got cranberry. Yeah. And I got blueberry. Okay. Blueberry, yay, yay. I pick this sauce. I'm gonna the chocolate one. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Woo! I think that's enough. Like that's enough. No. Ah! I think that's good. Here, don't. Like a chocolate leg. Here you go, man. I'm gonna put it on for you. Whoa. Looks like it's a chocolate good. lake. It's my chocolate. <laughs> put six pieces on yours. I'm gonna do it with a banana press. I'm gonna put some wine. on mine. That's what I should always do. I wanna put uh, marshmallows. So one, two, one. three. What 
banana party? <laughs> Seriously? What? Um, banana what party. Your... Hmm, put it one right there. Almost done. Just need to add some more. Back. Right here. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.